Hello everyone, LD3 back with you for another video. Today we are in the Golf Club 2. I almost said true. The Golf Looking Club so 2. And we are playing a course called Tropic Falls. So this course is a really exotic course. And the reason why um, I picked okay, it is well, because this sand. week it's the OAL, OHL Classic at Mayakoba on the PGA Tour. And that's played in Mexico, so I'm thinking Mexico, exotic... You know, just doing some cool stuff there. So I'm like, why not pick out an exotic sort of tropical course in a way to kind of play with the OHL Classic at Mayakoba. And this okay, is so what I found. Here. So I'm going to play this, hopefully have some fun, hopefully do well. I did play a couple practice rounds before I started recording, and I did not play well. So I am a little scared, to be honest with you, with how I am going here. to play today. Go. Um, let's start here. This is a very important putt to signify if I will do well today. Par putt, oh. and I miss. Oh, boy, a bogey to start off the round. This is not going to be a good round. I am very, Next very, very up. worried about this. Um, yeah, I didn't really – I think Starting I played three rounds, and the best round was a 73. The worst round okay, was an 87. Two. So I was here. very all over the place today when playing and getting ready to play this round. So I have no idea how it's going to be. Is this going to be closer? Is this going to be long, short, where? Oh, it's going to be right at the pin. Right at the pin. Okay, maybe I can make a putt here. Nice, nice approach. Maybe I, like I can make a putt. Oh, it's a straight putt. It's a straight putt. I just got to get it to the hole, and I do, and Perfect. it is a birdie. Let's go. Good start. Very okay, good start there even par. for nice. myself. And now we're back to even par, so we're doing all right here. And up. another par Take three. Interesting. Back-to-back -back par threes. You don't usually see that, so this is a little strange. Where's the hole? The hole's like back part of the green. So you know what? I'm just going to hit it and hopefully have it roll out towards the hole. That is Heading my plan. Stan. Oh, that's going to be good if it kicks a little left. It's not going to kick left, but it is going to be pin high about. On the green with and on the green. So I'm going to chip do. it up there. Or, not, or not even chip it up there. Just out. put it up there. Maybe get a birdie. Maybe get another birdie just like Great that. One under birdie. through three holes. Didn't expect that to happen okay, um, after that start. Round. But you know what? We have the number one handicap coming up. So nice who knows what hole. is going to happen? Number one handicap usually here. signifies bad things. It's the toughest hole in the course. Who knows what's going to happen? Am I going to hit the fairway? Oh, yeah. So that's going to kick right. That's going to be fine. That is going to be fine. Just don't... Is it going to kick all the way to the other side of the fairway? I almost thought it was going to kick all the way to the other side of the fairway, so and I, I wasn't even going to have a chance to get it in. That would have been here. really interesting. But now we are here. Um, it's going to be a pull shot plus the wind, so I'm going to aim like over here with the hybrid and just have it roll up near the hole. I don't even need it to get it on the green, just close enough. Oh, no. So get right, get right, get right, get right, get right! Oh boy, good. Oh boy, this is gonna be, this is gonna be great. I do have a decent shot, I guess. So that's a positive. But man, I am disappointed with that shot. That was a poor shot. This is might also be a poor shot if it sits. No, oh, I was hoping for a better shot there. All right, let's get out. Oh of boy, and this is like 500 here. yard par four too. So that it doesn't really help that. Um, that's Woo! a bogey that's chip right there. Now it's gonna right be a double bogey, bogey, and I'm gonna be back to over par. So right, that so is really, really disappointing. Let's see here. Boom. Oh, and I barely made that, too. Nice Double bogey. Yikes. Uh, not right. not the best round. hole, and it is the number one handicap, so I can kind of understand right. why. But now we got That's another 500-yard par four, two 500-yard par fours in the back-to-back -back after two par threes. I made two twos, and then I'm probably going to make two Looking sixes. Good. So that is really interesting. Don't get in the bunker. Don't get in the bunker. Oh, boy. Uh, you ended up in the like beach. I usually say, if my driving's so good, sorry. then everything else goes into place. But so far, my driving has been pretty below average, I would say. So it's not really working out that great. Um, like the first hole and the fourth hole, I both missed the fairway. And, or actually, I made the fairway. It was really, the second shot on the fourth hole, but still. Out of that sand. Two nice holes, job. two poor shots. It's going to mess me up. 
Maybe this can get close here. That would be the positive thing. Oh, get in. Oh, what a shot there. Now I'm going to have a chance to save par. Can we save par Let's here? That would be awesome. To save par here, maybe get a birdie somewhere else. Nice there we go. Good par. There. Par on a 500-yard par four. And I will take that. Um, but yeah, just to recap the PGA Tour last week, we had Patrick Cantlay winning at the Shriners Hospital for okay, Children Open. Um, I believe that's his first win, to be honest with you. So congratulations there. And wow, that's, this is a drop. This is a drop here on this drive. And like I say, usually, I love holes where you have huge nice. drops in the, fairway. in the fair, like to get to the fairway. That's awesome. I love those holes. Just because it show you can see out everywhere, and that's a 335-yard drive, by the way. Um, you can see like out everywhere. You can check everything out. You can the, the ball stays in the air for a lot longer, so it it's just a really fun shot to hit in general. So that's why I love to do it. And I'm not even gonna hit the fairway. I'm not even gonna be close to the fairway. Oh boy, I thought the wind was gonna bring that back. Apparently, the wind doesn't like to bring the ball back when it's in the air. Interesting, but yeah, Patrick Cantlay, congratulations to him. Uh, good win for him. Um, hopefully, he continues to win. He's been a name that's been, that's been like searching All for a right, while to win. He's been in contention a lot, so good, good for him to get that win. Proud of him. Whoa, oh, and I hit the flag stick. Right at the pin. Oh my goodness! If that right, dropped nice straight down, that would have been a birdie. But instead, Great it's a par. You know what? I'll take a par. It's a 650-yard par okay, five. So you can't not you take a par on that. Um, I do want to try to find a way and get a birdie somewhere, though. Close. But maybe not here. 250-yard par 3. Oh, boy. This is going to be interesting. Um, I'm going to put a bunch of loft on it and just see where it ends up. I really don't care where it ends up. I feel confident with my skills to no, possibly to get fight. it in. Oh, boy. That's not what I wanted to do. That is not what I wanted to do whatsoever. Well, I'm not right all the wow. time. Wow. Okay. Uh, um, so let's see. 14 yards. An ugly lie, down a little but, bit. So I'm going uh, to hit it like here. Hopefully have it roll out. That's going to roll out too much, is it? Oh. oh. I can never figure out the rollout with the chip shots. That's the one thing I've been trying to figure out for so long. But I've been unable to do so. Can I at least make the par putt? Whoa. I can. Nice, nice par save. Par. Very, very nice and par save. I appreciate my work the to get the par there. I'm still at one over. But yeah, this and week OHL Classic at Mayakova, another um, international event on the tour. They like to put all their international events except for the Canadian Open and British Open. In this fall series, which I honestly don't mind because it gives people more opportunities like when they're not like in their full season to go out and like travel and stuff. Oh, I hit a tree. I hit a tree, but I'm still in the fairway. I probably have no chance to reach the green, but interesting. I did hit the tree. Actually, I might still have a shot to reach the green. How about that? I'm still going to have a shot to reach the green. 500-yard par 4. I hit a tree, and I still might have a chance to reach the green. I'm going to be short, but honestly, that's not the worst place I could be after two shots. Just get up and down, make a par, do what I need to do, you know? Um, 14 yards. And, whoop, oh boy, that's going to be long. Long? No, it's not. It's actually going to be perfect. How about that? Bump and run into the hill to a foot and a half. I will okay, take that every day of the week. And, boop, par. Let's see how that nice. All, all right. Up. So that's really all I had to say about the tour. Okay, we so have, like, we're kind of winding down in the fall season. We have this, and I think okay, we have maybe, like, one go. more event. Like, one more official event, I'm pretty sure. Let me just bring the schedule up right now. So we have the OHL Classic this week, then the RSM Classic at Sea Island next week, which a lot of players are actually going to play because a lot of them live in Sea Island. So a lot of them want to play in their, like, hometown events. So a lot of top players like Matt Kuchar is probably going to play there. Um, there's a couple other people. Harris English, who hasn't really been playing great, but is still a pretty good player. He's probably going to play. Like... A lot of good players like to live in that Sea Island, Georgia area. So I wouldn't be surprised if, to see a lot of top players play in that event. Can this get to Looks the like hole? Is that even going to get to the hole? Here. Oh, it is. It's going to hop. It's going to hop. What a hop Fantastic from the rough. Approach. I did not expect that to now. happen. All right, nice that a hop from the back. rough did not That's expect that to Thank happen at man. all. And I get my birdie that and I needed. And now we are an even par to finish the front nine. 
I will take that. All right. I will absolutely Let's take that. Rip. I was scrambling a lot on that front nine. So getting a par there, very good work. So yeah, basically after that, that's the last official event on the PGA Tour schedule for the 2017 season because then we have the Hero World Challenge, which is Tiger's event, where he basically just brings like 18 of the top players in the world and just okay. play four rounds at, so in the Bahamas and just do whatever. It doesn't. It counts for, I believe it counts for world golf ranking points, but not for... Um, not for PGA Tour, like, FedEx Cup points. So, it's not really an official PGA Tour event, but it's Tiger's event, and a lot of top players play there. So, it's a fun event to watch, I would say. And then we have, in December, the QBE Pops Shootout in Naples, which is, I think, that team event that Greg Norman puts on every year. If I remember correctly, that's the event. That's a decent chip from where I was, to be honest with you. Um, so... That's always fun to watch. They have, like, alternate scary. shot, best ball. I think they might even have a scramble oh, on that one. section in it, too. So, who knows yeah, there? That, that would be a lot of not so fun to watch, I would say. Team formats. Coming Reminds me of my high school days playing team one. formats. See what it's here. a little different high school compared to, like, this team format because high school you don't have partners. You play for yourself, but then it, like, adds up scores and stuff like that. So, it's a little different, but... Still teams playing together, a lot of fun, different side of the sport. Would be interesting to watch Looking get good. to the green. That's all I want you to do is get to the green. I don't care where on the green it is, I just want it to be on the green. And that it shall be. It might roll back a little more, which honestly is okay because it makes it more pin high. So I will take that. Um, and then after that, we start out the 2018 season. So we're actually really close the starting the out 2018 on the PGA now. Tour. Yeah, and for the, bird. the winner, is, there's a lot of good events in the winter. We have the Hawaii events. We have Torrey Pines. We have Pebble. That is a terrible putt. Oh, my goodness. Is that going to roll back to my feet? It probably is. No, it's actually going to stay there. Yikes. Okay, but an 18 I can't believe that here. stayed, number one. And two, I can't believe how terrible that was. And I'm going to be short again. The shadows are killing me. I can't even figure out where this hole is. Uh, it's going to be a bogey. Dang it. Um, bogey. Yep. Solid All right. One bogey. over again. Good putt. Again, not terrible, one seeing as I round. shot an 87 in one of my practice rounds today. So, okay, and we find it's not now terrible. It's not great, though. I will definitely expect better. Um, let's just hit a good drive here, and maybe I can get a birdie on this par 5. Nice. Get it back to even par. Way. That would be the best thing in the world, and it's going to be right down the middle because I'm an absolute boss at driving sometimes. Um, but, yeah, that's really all I have to say about the tour. Um, not really sure if there's anything else going on around the world in terms of golf. Um, haven't really been paying that much attention because I've had a lot of schoolwork to take care of. So, haven't really been paying attention on the news and stuff, so I apologize there. But, but yeah, a couple interesting events coming up in the next couple weeks, and then we got the Hero World Challenge, the shootout. And then the PGA Tour season kicks up again. Really excited to see what's going to happen, see how the top players respond to their good or bad years from last year. That's got to sit a little bit. It's not the worst. It's not the best. I'll take that chip shot. I just want to make sure I make the putt for, for the par. birdie here. That's really all I'm worried about at this point. I'm going to miss it, aren't I? Oh, yes. it loops right in. And I fall okay, to the ground in celebration, like, yes, I can't nice. believe I did it. Oh, that was a birdie. I didn't even realize that was my birdie putt. Thank okay, you. It's time That's to awesome. That's why I was way. celebrating a lot, because it was my birdie putt. I understand now why I celebrated so much. Um, And that's going to be in the water, isn't it? This fairway is too narrow. That's like what? Like a 15-yard fairway right, no with worries. water on each side? Yet. That is... That is an absolutely terrible spot to put. Yards, like, uh, to that's pitch. an absolutely atrocious fairway, especially with side, like the side wind that it had. Like that made no sense whatsoever. Um, but I guess that's okay if I can get a good recovery shot right here, which in. looks like I am. There we go, right on the green. It's gonna be pin high in the fringe. Oh, stop rolling, please. Thank you. Still have a chance at par, I guess. So. I always have that, and it's actually not a bad chance at par if I can get the ball to the hole. Yeah, there we go. What a par save. 
What a par save indeed. Great work there. And I'm still at even par. You know what? Even par is okay, let's see what happens even par this, is good. Uh, par I, I know, like I said last episode or like a couple episodes ago, that like breaking par is my goal. But when I'm not playing well, even par is an absolutely legendary performance. Um, but you know what? Even if I do, if I do get even par today, I will absolutely take it. Um, and that's a nice drive just past the bunker. Good I'm stuff. surprised I didn't end up in that bunker to be honest with you. I found every single bunker today, so. No, I was really hoping not to find it, and I didn't, so yay me. Um, can I reach the screen, you think? Do you think I can get there? Um, it's I'm trying. Perfect and fast, so who knows? Oh, I'm going to be up there. I'm going to be up there. 245, 250. Right at the front edge, and I can just do a little chip and putt. Make the birdie. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, I should... You think the chip's gonna be too much? It might, so I might just do a little upsy daisy on the loft. But then it's going to check. Ugh, boy, I can't here. figure out this. I can't figure out the chipping right now, and it's really bugging me, but that's okay because we're Nicely gonna make a putt for birdie anyway. Woohoo! Whoopsie do! I don't know what I'm saying anymore, but I'm happy about it. Woo! Fifteenth hole. Alright, fifteen. Okay, is this a drivable par 4? It is. 282. Um, I don't know how to feel about this one, to be honest with you. It's downwind. 265 goes there. It's down 39 feet, so I think I could get there with a 3-wood. Can I really just drive a green right now with a 3-wood? Am I going to be allowed to drive a green Looks with a 3-wood? Like I the am. Short stuff here. Wow, be good. Be good. Sit. Sit. Get in the hole. What, what a shot. What a shot Whoa, right uh, there. Yeah, wow. The and under on That's this one. seven you feet for Eagle putt. on a par four where I go. just hit a three wood. And I'm not the longest hitter, too, so it's like, are you crazy and I missed the putt? Oh, that was slightly disappointing. Don't get too down on yourself. Uh, the I'm just slamming all. my head on the microphone right now. I apologize. I'm not sure if you even heard that. I was just like, boop, boop, boop. Two but, under for the rest. Uh, it is a birdie, so I'll take that, and I'm two under now, but oh my goodness. Okay, that is go. absolutely disheartening. I had seven feet for birdie, and I was unable to get it done. That's terrible. I apologize. This was um, get in the bunker, 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 hit the flag. Oh, I hit the flag. So close to the ace. All the flags, my best friend today. Approach, oh, God. thank you, flag. If that didn't hit nice. the flag, that, that was 20 bird. yards over the green. But instead, I hit the flag, and it's within a foot round. and a half, and I make another birdie. Four birdies in the last five holes. Man, I am having a back nine to remember okay, right now. This is absolutely Take crazy. I'm loving it. Shot. I am loving it so much. This is absolutely insane. Um, let's just see if we can get a good drive off here. This is the 17th hole, by the way. I'm not e Is this Looking the 17th so hole? I think it is. Oh, wow. Okay, now that is a good drive. I wish I could do that on that other hole where it was like the same width fairway, but at okay, the same time it was like about water on each side. If there wasn't water on each side and no crosswind, I would have been perfect. But instead, it decides to put water on both sides and a crosswind, so I have zero chance of hitting that fairway. Um, but that's gonna not be a terrible shot. Wind was in the face, so it's gonna end up a little short. I'm perfectly fine with that. If it's like 15 yards, yeah. It should be an easy lobber, I think. Easy lobber. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, and now it rolls out! Oh! My goodness, I should have put the loft on it instead, but I guess not. And now I'm going to have a par putt that I'm probably going to miss, which I do. Slightly to Disappointing there. Oh, boy. Three feet I to the am... hole here. Very disappointed with the result there. After Let's that great see, drive and a pretty decent second shot. Poor chip, poor putt. And Sitting now I get another bogey. But you know what? I can get a bogey on the last hole and sh up, still shoot under par on this course. On I am hole. very happy with that. Here. This course actually seems very difficult. So getting under par with, like, the crazy right, slopes and so stuff far. and, like, all that jazz, I would be very happy with an under par round right now. Very happy. So... Let's keep on keeping on and trying 
to do awesome because being awesome is always fun. And maybe I can be awesome with a second shot here. Oh, what a shot. What a shot. Lands it before the green rolls it up. It's rolling a little bit away from the hole, but you know what? Maybe I can get a nice putt here and finish off the round strong with a three under par round. For can we bird. make the last putt? It's a 17-foot putt. Can we make it to finish the round strong? We're not even going to be close. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was absolutely okay, trash. I apologize. Maybe we can make this putt to finish the round. We do. Okay, we finish with a par. I'll take that. Two under par. Horse challenge complete round and score. A 68. Under, so, you know what? I will take that there. round. Well, it's off the Especially well, how I started. It was, it was a pretty... Uh, let's look at the scorecard. It was, it was an okay start. It went bogey, birdie, birdie, double. And then, how many birdies did I have? Did I have seven birdies? Solid. Seven birdies on the round. I will absolutely take that. That is awesome. I, I don't think I've had a, that many birdies in my life before. Um, <laughs> no, I have. But it's that's a lot of birdies. And my handicap index went down? Was it a 3.1 when I started? I didn't even know. But... In either case, that's going to be the end of the episode. Enjoy the OHL Classic at Mayakoba. I'm going to see if they have the Sea Island course for next week. I really have... I'm kind of disappointed I haven't been able to play any of the PGA Tour courses on here in a while. But hopefully that changes next week. But who really knows? But yeah, that is going to do it here for me. So if you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and drop it with a like. Go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more from me. And I will see you guys with a new video real soon. Bye.